Oh, hi. Just picking up some dog poop for Halloween night. I'll meet you in the hideout. Oh, there's some more. My name is Weetstone Holmes, and I was born at the right time to grow up with the video game industry. I've seen a lot. Glitches, intended weirdness, unintended weirdness, whatever I can find that'll make you think this must be... October 31st, but I haven't seen it all. That's what I'm counting on. Now I do voices for games, play games, and review games. This is the hideout. Well, well, look who shambled into the hideout. Welcome, my fiends. Today I have a scary clip from a game in 3D. It's from a game that you would not usually think of when you think of scary video games. So it'll be a surprise, unless you've already watched this video before. Which I hope you watch it several times, I do. But first, I will give you a few facts about October 31st. And I'll share some scary things as we go along. It will give the show momentum. So let's hit it. And now some fun facts about October 31st. This Halloween, Americans will consume three pounds of sugar, sugar via the process of eating candy. They'll eat that much sugar in candy. Well, it sounds pretty crazy, but if you consider how long it takes some people to eat candy, I mean, when I was a kid, my friends and siblings, it took us a week or two weeks to eat all the candy we got on Halloween, so it took us a long time. So it actually doesn't sound that bad when you put it in that perspective. One Halloween, uh, the grown son of a neighbor came over and he strung wires all over the place, all over the yard. And they were probably about three inches off the ground. And when it started getting dark, it was very hard to see those wires, as you can imagine. And I myself landed on my face probably three or four times. I was not happy about it. Anyway, later on, the teenagers were talking about watching a movie. And this was the 80s, so back then we were talking VHS, you know, v VCRs, the old videotapes, you know. And they kept saying something about this Donna the De Dead. Donna the Dead. Who in the heck is she? I mean, I was a little kid. I didn't know who in the heck this Donna the Dead was. And it took me until I was an, an adult to find out that it was Dawn of the Dead. Dawn of the Dead, made in 1978. I wasn't there when they watched it, so I didn't know anything. Samhainophobia is the fear of Halloween. I don't know anybody that's afraid of it, but <laughs> eh, there is a phobia, apparently. The first mention of trick-or-treating was in 1927, and it happened to be in Canada. Most people think of Halloween as a U.S. holiday, which I guess it mainly is. I mean, I've heard UKers say we don't have anything like ha Halloween. Well, yeah, you used to, but it was mainly Irish. But anyway, besides that, it was first mentioned in Canada. Yeah. Harry Houdini, the famous escape artist and self-proclaimed king of cards, died on October 31st. 1926 and he vowed to return through the spirit world or whatever contact his wife through the spirit world however considering that Houdini didn't believe in spiritualism that's kind of a strange thing for him to say that he would do anyway the last fact is about apples Candy apples. Don't. You've always heard the thing about the razor blades being in candy apples or candy. And cutting some little kid's mouth, they had to take them to a, the emergency room. You've probably heard the story. Well, turns out it's an urban myth. Nobody actually got hurt by razor blades in candy or apples. 
Nobody. I mean, that's pretty incredible. I'm sure they've seen them, maybe. I don't know. Maybe people look too closely and nobody does it anymore. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, those are the facts, I guess. Cronus Actual, you copy? We gotta talk, boss. It's getting strange in a hurry out here. Coronas, come in. Can anyone hear me? Oh, we can hear you. This is Lost Planet 3. A game about a miner. Okay, he's an adult who works for a mining company, and he's on a frozen planet. I've just come across this strange structure. Shall we explore it together? Let's see what's going on. Who do you suppose built this? Capcom? And when they run off to? Mm, Japan? Oh, paranormal activity! Walk in freezer flaps! Batman? Yeah, things just got real, guys. This is a spooky, spooky place. So I'm just gonna pick up these energy tanks. I don't know why I'm doing this. It's too spooky to be doing this kind of thing. The elevator. What are you talking about? Are you a mortician? Uh oh. Yeah. Alien. Oh no, I'm horrible at this. Fair warning. He's <laughs> going a mile. <laughs> Got it that time, I think. Wow, that is incredibly hard. Hey, don't watch if you get seizures. Seizure warning. More tea energy, which I shouldn't be picking up when things could be sneaking up behind me. Ammo I need. Dead guys I don't need. Supermarket freezers. The plastic. It's like <laughs> the whole planet's freezing, but don't let the cold out. Alien. <sighs> Gosh, I thought I had him. They'll be feeding on my boots. We'll go buy some. They're at the grocery store. Delicious little marshmallow things with sugar on them. People eat them for Easter and Access sometimes Halloween denied. and Christmas. <laughs> oh. I can't get out. Aliens denied. Not the same door? Oh, never mind. Okay. Forget about that. Forget that I turned around and went to the wrong door. 
Nothing behind me, that's good. Should have known. Alright, where are you? Who's gonna jump up and eat me in the face? Come on, volunteers? Anybody? Fielder? Initiating reset protocol. Generator temporarily offline. Reboot sequence in progress. Okay. No one. Oh my gosh. Generator reboot sequence complete. This ain't Generator good. Now online. Eat a grenade, sucker. Eat another one. I'm not sure if those grenades actually did anything. Oh, there's one more. Two more. Yeah, forget him. I don't really care anymore. Getting close to the outside. Maybe I'm just getting close to getting my face eaten. Spooky. Now, after a short loading period, we're back. And spookier than ever. Performing containment analysis. Please okay, that was easy. Any indigenous life forms within the station to the appropriate zone manager. Who's the appropriate Have zone manager? Everyone's dead. This is gonna be one of those days. Mm -hmm. Garage lockdown in effect. Okay. Locked. There's gonna be an override. There oh there's always an override. I'm going completely the wrong way, aren't I? Ah, yeah. There it is. And spider webs. That doesn't bode well. Go to tunnel, or go to, what was that? Go to newly opened hallway. A door open somewhere, go to it. Don't tell me what to do, game. I'm gonna bust you up. Another loading screen. How many loading screens is it going to be, guys? Come on, give us a break here. Oh, that was fast. Nobody's going to believe me about this place. You guys that are watching it can believe it, can't you? And any other answers I can find. And a Twinkie, too. Then why 
Stop shooting him. I'm never stop shooting him. Shooting them is what I do. Oh, come on. I'm not going to read any text. I mean, who reads text? <laughs> Okay, I'm going to read some text. Alright, that's enough. That was fascinating. Okay. We got big aliens. Ooh, good one. I hope you guys jumped, because I did. I don't even know what that means. And yet, I'm picking up tea canisters again. I'm in danger of having my face hugged, and I'm picking up tea canisters. Oh, no. Oh, I'm Horrible. Ooh. Have a grenade. Have a banana. like floating in the air. <laughs> These guys remind me of the snipe cats. What people call snipe, snipe cats on uh Risk for rain. But, yeah, see? It's like the 3D representation of the snipe cats from Risk for Rain. <laughs> uh oh, gotta repair something. It's sort of like Batman, the Batman games. You just kind of wiggle the sticks around until it turns blue and. Boop, there you go. Anything hidden? Who knew? Does that mean a big one's out there? I mean a really big one. And dead end. Does the rolling help? Peekaboo! These things look like ladders, but I don't think they are. I don't know why I'm going here. It's a dead end. Gee whiz. It's probably real simple, and I'm just being stupid. Happens to the best of us. Just bear with me for a moment. Okay. Just looking around for some kind of console, computer console, something, ammo, I don't know. Computer console, there we go. That was easy. Ah, eh, great. The 
music and atmosphere is really good on this game. I've got to hand it to them. Spooky tunnels. And the floor drops. And that's it for our spooky look at Lost Planet 3. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me in the hideout on this special October 31st edition of the WH Game Hideout. Until I see you next time, keep your glasses on. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Well, well, look who shambled into the White, the white House. <laughs> what in the heck am I thinking? Woo!